I saw these strawberries in Whole Foods. They're the omakase berry from Oishi Farms. These berries are vertically farmed, pesticide-free, nutrient-rich, hyper-local, perfectly ripe, non-GMO, and always in season. I I think I've seen Emma Chamberlain try these and um, they were like $11. So I just wanted to try them once and see if they were good because apparently they're very delicious. Why do I need to consume it at room temperature? I don't want to do that. They smell good. Do I have to wait? I'm not gonna wait. Sorry. Oh my god. This is perfect. This is the best. This is great. Oh my god. They're so sweet and flavorful. Like perfectly ripe. This is crazy. If every strawberry tasted like this, this would be the only thing I would eat ever. I would consume 10 pounds of this. Maybe I'm being dramatic. Maybe I'm being crazy. Maybe I've been deprived of properly ripe fruit since living in New York. I can't even begin to describe the struggle it is to find ripe fruit that doesn't mold in like two days. I've been advised to shop for fruits and veggies that are in season, um, which makes sense, but I'm just so used to having all kinds of produce. Came from Oregon, which has so many farms and grows so many fruits. A lot of, like you can get local produce so easily. And I'm sure that's true here in New York too. I just don't know where to find them. This needs to be my like once a month splurge. Like now that I've tasted them, I can't forget. These are dangerous. I'm gonna buy these every time I go grocery shopping. I can't do that. They were $11. This was an amazing experience. I am going to buy these again. It's Friday night. I'm going to meet some friends at a bar and then I'm gonna come right back home because um, I have to get up early tomorrow. So this was my Friday. I went grocery shopping today. It was really fun because I tried to order like half of my stuff on Instacart and so I didn't have to carry as much. That's my Friday. Until next time. Just a moment I'm so grown up In my own apartment Cooking my own dinner Spaghetti for one Though I'm getting older My life has just begun I wish it would slow down Even for a second I'm so old now Left my adolescence Going out to parties And getting way too drunk Think I found somebody But don't think that it's love I wish it would slow down Slow that I need to get shortened um, in Bushwick, so it's nice that it's so close. It's really cold today. Back from the Taylors, I just had lunch. I'm going to East Village because I need to look for a dress tonight. My friend invited me to a masquerade birthday party, so I'm gonna try to find um, a mask or some masks um, and then a dress would be fun um if i can't find anything like no worries i can probably like makeshift something but i don't have a nice like little gown a little evening dress so that's what i'm going to try to find
Haul time. Okay. Not completely sure if we're still going to the party. So I just got this for fun, actually. Let's begin, okay? I got this Tommy Hilfiger sweater. Look how cute it is. It's so oversized, but it's so cute. Look at it. I love it. Tis the season for sweaters. This is just like so cute for Christmas, for any time that it's cold, actually. It's like so well-made, so structured. I like this color, this color scheme. This, this is what I got for the masquerade party slash I have been looking for a skirt like this. I stopped by this vintage curated shop um, in the East Village and they had this black, like, pleated sort of skirt out on the rack. This was $10. That's why it was like 38, by the way. You can see it has like little buttons and the texture, the ruffles, the pleats of the skirt. And these two items go together, which is such a plus. I bought these Micron pens. These are my favorite to draw with. I just missed drawing. I also got a little sketch pad. Usually I'll get the sketch pad with the binder on the side, but I um, don't really like that. Sometimes I feel like I rest my hand on it and it hurts. Um, so I decided to get one with the binder on the top. Hopefully this is posted after my cousin comes back home. I got her this little Sagittarius gemstone box. They're like stones curated for the signs. Um, and she's a Sagittarius, so I got this for her. Ah, okay, as you saw, I went to Michael's. I wanted to try and get some holiday decorations. I didn't like anything that was in there. They were out of the ribbons that I wanted, but I bought these two fun little ribbons just like for my hair, for wrapping presents, all the things. So I got cute little emerald color, and then this one is like, I don't even know. You know how like wool coats will have this pattern sometimes? It, it just reminded me of like a coat and I thought it would be cute, so. Got those. Also, I painted my nails. Do you like them? They're like a little pearl color. That's it for the haul. I really wanted microwave popcorn, but I don't feel like going back out just for that. So I might scrummage through my pantry and see what I have. Okay, I'm running a little late, but here's my outfit. I'm so happy. I feel like this is me in my full form. I feel so great and just so cool. Like I thrifted this, this was from a costume store. These boots, I got from a flea market in Portland. Yeah, thrifted baby, thrifted, vintage, second hand. Unfortunately, it is a raincoat night. It has not stopped drizzling since 12 o'clock, even though the weather app, it said it would only rain for one hour today. It has not happened. Rain chic. I was thinking about this, but this would drive me crazy. I need to be able to carry things, you know? I have to go. I'll see you later. Hi, I left the apartment once today and that was to check the mail. My wildflower cases case came in. I ordered one, as you can see. This is the case, little fruits. I love fruit. It's so cute. Goodbye, old phone case. Honestly, this case has done a good job of protecting my phone since I got it. A wildflower cases girl once again. Hello? So cute, I'm so happy about this. Okay, running out of battery, just wanted to show you how cute she is. Mm -hmm.